Greetings, we're back. I uh, had some baby bears coming out here in seven seconds, and I wanted to record this um, moment, right? So it just it just kicked out a uh, accept, right? And I got to get on top of this because if I don't feed it immediately, then uh, they start to die. So I got to like start stuffing potatoes into them uh, right away, and then. I think there's one more. Ooh, 49. That's a good one. Cause you, what you do is you have to, uh, you have to get them up, right? So I gotta get them in the little hut, or they'll they'll die from the cold. Okay, I gotta change the 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 distance. I gotta hurry up. So behavior lowest behavior target. Oh, that's the wrong one. Behavior lowest. Behavior, the lowest, right? And I just got to get them in here. I got to get them in here. I got to get them in here. So as soon as they're in here, I'm going to try to get them as close as I can. Oh, see, the, the thing already went away. So you, you, turn them off, right? And then, oh, come on. Uh, behavior, lowest, okay. Make sure you got some food. Got to continue to stuff food on them. Get in here. Come on. Did I change the wrong one? Behavior, no. Behavior, behavior, disable, disable wandering. Behavior, follow distance lowest. Target range, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, that's what happened. Okay, there's another one out here, I think. I don't know where the other one went. Oh, come on, come on, don't be retarded. They're not all supposed to follow me, come on. Okay, get in here. Get in here. Okay. Okay. So you, 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 right? And then I got to say behavior, disable wandering, behavior, enable, okay. Behavior, disable wandering. Okay. So there, nobody's following me. Okay. Except now behavior, uh, behavior, disable wandering. Follow me. So I got to get him in here because he's cold. It's kind of fast, and I know I'm talking through it. I'm talking through it, and I'm like, come on. Come on, guy. Get in here. Oh, so I got to do lowest behavior, lowest. Because what happens is, is they, they uh, there we go. There we go. Behavior, um, disable follow. There we go. Close the doors. And this does two things. A, this keeps them from uh, a little bit of heat management. And so I just have the outside fires going. And then uh, I'll stuff potatoes on them. I'll just keep stuffing potatoes. And some people say beans are the best. You know, and to be honest, maybe I want to do a, so we got a 43, 49, 47, 49. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to say I put some doors in here so I can get in and out of here without cracking the big doors. I think I'm going to do a um, I'm going to do a, uh, a a metric. I'm going to do um, one guy was saying if you do beans, then it does better. So I'm going to the one I can risk is the 43, obviously. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to swap out and feed this guy nothing. But uh little little uh berries right and then everybody else 43 gets berries and then everybody else gets potatoes and then i gotta just try to early game try to stuff see the thing with potatoes is it fills you up more so like for example if I eat a potato so my food my food is at 25 so if I say consume Right, so that's at 25, put it at 30.7. If I eat a berry, so was that two points? So there's a big difference from two points to five points. So it gives it a uh, kind of more of a, a life, a lifespan is what it does. And so 
I want to try to stuff as many. I don't think it's, it might not matter. It might. But it's got a bigger chunk of food that it goes off of. So every time he eats it, it's stuffing more food in there. Um, so it's forcing the health up. I think the health will be, man, these are all males. These are the male, male, male. Holy shit, four males, right? Let me just make sure that there's not one outside. I have this suspicion that there might be. If you hold down H, sometimes you'll see the arrows, right? So that will replace my male, right? My current breeder, because my current breeder male is um, is is wild level F, wild level forty three. Right, so going from 43 to, uh, well, both of these are 49. Yeah, from wild level 43 to 49. That'll be a pretty big, uh, and so I can, I'll sell this one. This is a wild level 43. But um, let's see if the stats mirror. So this is 58, 900. 650. Okay, this has got a higher health than some of the other ones. This one's got same. And this one's got less. It's got the lesser health. Okay. So these two, these two have the higher health. That's why it kicked up in level. So 900 stamina, 158 damage, and then the extra 200 health. 200 health is a big deal, right? And so when these guys level up, um there we go and this gets kind of gets them out of that danger zone plus it's hitting day so now they're the most vulnerable and i'll just continue to stuff stuff food in them i'll just stuff continue to stuff food yeah see this one's got oh this has got the lower the lower health as well so 43 47 i what i wanted to wait 10 and 83 Ten forty-five. So yeah, a little bit, little bit of a hit on the 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 weight also. Um, let's see here. I'll bet you that these probably hit quicker on the percentage. Maybe not. Maybe not. We'll see. We'll do a we'll do a berry metric test. But yeah, but somebody was saying beans. Somebody was saying beans is where it's at. So I'll. I'll start, I'll go pick, buy, get some bean seeds. I'll go buy some bean seeds and then I'll make the, the journey up here. Yeah, so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause the video because you don't need to watch me feed bears for two hours. And um, I'll kind of check back in at 5%. And because right now we're at 0.3, so at 0.5, I mean, no, 5%, 5%. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. 5%, right? Because we're not even 1% yet. So like it says, you know, once care in eight hours. So the thing the thing that, I, that I'm going to do, uh, I'm probably not, I don't know, I mix because I'm probably not going to, I might, but I'm probably not going to, um, uh, do the little like do the care thing because that's only to me and my goal is to um, breed these up another notch so I'll take you know I'll take the use one of these as the males and then I'll breed you know I'll hit the mothers again and then I'll try to push it into the 51 52 kind of range and so these guys you know these guys are kind of like not keepers per se, you know, I'll have the one male. And so they're, you know, they're going to be sold or, I mean, I could, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, but it, they're, they're just, um, you know, they could, I could use them for treasure map bears, but ultimately one of them is just going to be uh, like a breed, a breeder bear. And the other one's, you know, I want to take one of them to another island and uh, use it to farm penguins for oil and stuff, but 
Yeah, 49 is pretty good. Yeah, last time I got a 49. And uh, but that's if you think about it, 43 to 49. What is that? Five levels? No, six levels. That's a six level bump in my mail, right? So that's that's pretty good. They all kind of have a kind of a very brown bear look to them. Um, yeah. Uh, I've seen I've seen some people where they get this. They get this attack rate, this 158%, and they get it up to like 186. They breed it up to 186. And those things, they get nasty. They get nasty. Um, you know, but the health, the health is kind of nice too. The health is a nice. So both of these appear to be the same. Let me see. Weight 183. Weight 183. Food 4,800. Yeah, these, these two are identical. And I just keep stuffing food in them. Even though now I probably got enough enough food in there to last 10 minutes or 15 minutes. You know. Um, yeah. Yeah. I got enough food to last. Yeah, so 64, so it holds the same amount of volume, basically. Yeah, 68, 66, so it's almost the same amount of volume. Okay, I'm going to pause this. I'm going to pause this. Gotten our, we're back, and we've gotten our, we're at 9.9%, and uh, you can see here, 9.9. .9. I tried the berries, and I tried the potatoes. It didn't make a difference. They... They all finished, if I go over here, they've all kind of finished at the same same spot. You know, I've had to mess around with the fires because they keep freezing to death. You know, it's cold outside. It's, I'm in like in a tundra, kind of not, you know, not the Arctic, but the tundra. If I hold down H, it tells me the temperature. So it says it's zero degrees outside. So if I like start turning this stuff off, you know, you'll see, you'll see the little the little turn off fire you'll see the little the little eskimo thing come up and so a few times the little palm tree came up and that meant that they were too hot so i've had to i kind of had to manage go back and forth uh up oh, see the little see the little eskimo things pop up but it's okay because they're at 9.9 .9. they're not going to die you know in that last little bit if i hit h if i or if I hit I, uh, you'll see here their hit points, and it'll go down. They'll slowly go down right here, and then eventually they'll run out and they'll die if you don't manage their. See, these guys got the heat because of they're pulling it off the fireplace. So if I come back over here and light this back up, you'll see you'll see it eventually. It'll drop off. See, it dropped off. I guess I guess it's holding on that last little bit. That 9.9. .9. Okay, this guy at 9.9. 9. .9, 9 point. Yeah, surprised he gave me all four males. 9.9. .9. Yeah, but they're so and then the the uh up oh, there's 10. So when they get to 10, oh, because the fire went out. When they get to 10, it's supposed to pick up from the trough. It's supposed to get off the trough. Let me turn this one on. Is this one good? Yeah, light fire. Let's see if that works. The trough is supposed to show up. And I got four troughs out there. Maybe if I move them around. T, 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 T. Let me see. Let me just move them. Maybe, maybe a little bit of... Uh... There you go. Okay. You, 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 you. Okay. But the trough is supposed to show up above their head. Um, I've heard it can be like, you know, 10.5 or 10 point. But once they once they hit that trough, you no longer have to worry about the freezing and the. Watch. Let me let me turn this stuff off and see if I still get the. The the. All the little heat up. Oh, see it pop back up. Pop back up.
Yeah, once it once it trips up, oh, there it is. See how all of a sudden it switched over to the trough, and you can see that little, you can barely see a little floaty, floaty trough thing above their name. Yep, see that? They got a little floaty trough thing. That means they're they're on the trough now, and they no longer are gonna feed off this stuff. I don't think. So if I wanted to, I could I could just pull all this stuff out. I'll leave one in. And uh, you know. I can pull all of these potatoes out because they're now they're feeding off the trough. Yeah, it didn't make a difference. I want to try beans because I heard beans will. Yeah, yep. See, trough, little tiny baby trough right there above the bear. You'll see a tiny, tiny little little icon. I'm trying to get it to where to where it uh, you can make them out. Right, right, right at the very tip of my axis, right there, right at the top of the tip of the axe, you'll see the little, little, little trough icon. I don't know if you can make that out. I'm kind of touching it with the top of my axe. See it right there? And then this one, this one is right, right there. See it? Can you see the little, little tiny trough icon at the top of the axe? Just a little tiny little symbol right there. Yep. And that means they're feeding, they're feeding off of these out here. Uh, these little troughs right here. I, so I put one on the ceiling there. I put one down here. Put one up here. Just like, and the thing is, is when like when the potatoes in here, it lasts for four hours and fifty six minutes. When it's in my inventory, it only lasts an hour and thirty two minutes. So I try to, I try to dump everything in the troughs because it's like a food extender, and so you get more life, you get more life out of the um. So a lot of times what I'll do is I'll I'll cycle it. There you go. I'll cycle it and then because it'll it'll compress, it'll stack everything. And you can see six hours and forty eight minutes, thirty four minutes. So I might have to I might have to stuff these back. You can see I'm I've been picking some serious potatoes. Um, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. So I think I think when though when I do that though I do damage the time. I think that I think that's technically what I'm doing. But um and I'll just stack these on here. I don't care. But you get the idea like um T is the the, the quick transfer. And then uh There we go. There we go. So, so yeah, that's how that's how it's done. Uh, breeding babies. I, you know, I thought I was gonna come back at five percent, but I didn't really see the need to. So I thought I would just uh, just close it out right at ten. But it it took almost four hours of stuffing potatoes in there to get to this point. All right, thanks for watching.